having a very wholesome walk with Oscar pre-holiday. Pre um, we're not going to go to the pub. I've got my nails done. Shout out to Soho in Leeds. You're the best. I did get a pedicure, but my mum says my feet are ugly, so I'll just keep showing you these instead. The silk one's top. No. Oh, the silk one's top. <laughs> no. no. <laughs> Oh, someone's a fan. <laughs> There's no I in team, but there is a me. Mm, okay, nice spelling. <sighs> I've got my I've got my moon. You must have some over there, though. Then we'll test the bad sure. and so the moon cup. It's clean. What's a moon cup? You put it in. And you... And it, and it's straight into it. Yeah. And then you pull it out and, you know. How can you know when you're coming on it? The reason I'm talking about this today is because uh, my mother always told me that a period shouldn't be a taboo subject. Because that makes it a thing. Proven by a book, which I have, where I don't know where it is. If anybody reads Period, but I can't remember who it's by, I feel like it's by Laura Bates, you should read it. Men as well, especially actually, because, you know, it's important. It's important shit. I'm gonna write that down. <laughs> this is the book I was talking about by Emma Barnett, not Laura Bates, The Wrong Feminist. But honestly, it's so good. And I think every boy growing up should read this because it just, it, it's about the struggles of, having a period and also like the amazing things about it so it's very important everybody should read it oh what banger so recently my friend libby my friend libby has been telling us all about like how to be zero weight i don't even know if i'm in the camera shot i bet i'm not oh, shit. But, but anyway these bars from Lush, they're shampoo bars. They're not liquid, so you can take them on holiday and on the plane and your hand luggage and stuff. These bars are shampoo bars, and all you do is like lather your hands up with them and stuff and, and rub your hair, but they're not liquid. Smell it. it smells like cinnamon. Oh, it stinks. It smells like Christmassy cinnamon. So that's shampoo, and that's like to encourage hair growth. It's got all these things in it that make you encourage hair growth. The girl at Lush was so nice. Um, and then this is. This is honey conditioner. Smell that one. That's my bad. And you can take them on a plane. <laughs> so clever. But we bought these originally for Velma um, because we didn't want plastic in Velma. So trying to go as plastic free as possible by the time we live in her. So you get these little tins as well with them. And um, yeah, I just think they're so handy for holidays as well. So keep, keep your eye on those. We do have these big bags full of plastic, so, hmm. you know, you win some, you lose some. Ow! You didn't know I was just vegan. I'm vegan so, now. So naked one, but there was some sour, because you thought it was sour cream on top of it. But it was all right. It was, it was garlic like mayo, mayo, which is so vegan, wrong, but it's fine. So, so, yeah, if you didn't know, I'm a vegan now. And um, I can't be vegan when we're in full material because it wouldn't be fair on my mum to make her make meal for five and then one meal for me. And I did that for five years as a vegetarian, so I just felt it, it was unfair. So I've decided when I do go to Form Zero, I won't be vegan. <clears throat> um, I'm in so much pain. Those jalapenos are so spicy. Well, I th it was a challenge, wasn't it? Anyway, Tim's still doing his work. He's, he's currently having to sit down with me. Oh, he deserves it, doesn't he, Oscar? Yeah, he does. Rate your sit down, we out of 10. Seven. Ooh. 
Why? Why did it drop three points? Still got a dissertation to finish. Okay, ready with me? <laughs> um, Alexa, turn the volume down more. Frequently, I tried to pick my battles till the battle picked me. Misery, like the war of words, I shouted in my sleep. And you passed right by. I was in the alley, surrounded on all sides. And knife cuts both ways if the shoe fits. Walking it till you hide it's great. And I fell from the pedestal right down the rabbit hole Long story short, it was a bad attack I pushed from the precipice, clung to the nearest lips Long story short, it was the wrong guy I'm all about you I'm all about you, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm all about you, yeah. My dad's not here to organise my life, so I'm running out of time Um, I'm gonna, I was gonna do a nice little Here's me making a coffee at three in the morning, but um, I don't have time. So, see you at the airport. <laughs> we made it through, didn't bother filming it because the whole thing was a very stressful experience for me. And we didn't get touched up. We didn't, sadly. We missed that part today, didn't we? Um, my clothes are all in the hold. They don't have a lock on, I swear. If they go missing, I'm gonna cry. Because I bought so many. Uh oh. So much just dropped my bag on me. She was crying. She was crying before, sure. Um, so, um, now I'm on a mission to get Tess a birthday card. Show out. Forgot your birthday card. Remembered your present though. Um, and get some euros, and Tim's gonna finish his uni work. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No comment. I'm stressed. He's very stressed. He nearly shouted at me for nearly forgetting his laptop. Which for, me, for me forgetting the laptop. For him forgetting the laptop. <laughs> um, but luckily I kept my cool because I understand he's dealt with very stressful situations of mine before. Walking into the gate. He just finished uni. Forever. Woo! No more education. No more education. Are nice and clear. If you need a hand, our cabin crew. We're flying jet too, so I'm just waiting for the Jess Quinn song to come on. These symptoms, however mild, please get our cabin crew known. Uh, we also children. been here ages but we have literally just slept all day haven't we um, we conked out my all night I caught up with me yeah um, and my three hours of sleep calling me <laughs> don't fall in so yeah first first thing we did beer <laughs> <laughs> straight into lunch wine and then a swim of course isn't it once you had a bit of alcohol, go for a swim, right? And Tim can't dive. Tim can't dive, and I'm good at diving. I can front flip. Yeah, you do. I don't think you meant to do that, though. I don't. I don't. Are you kidding? 
No, I just feel like it wasn't. I'm very, I'm very cloudy. good. I'm very, very good. I promise we're having a great time. The weather's nice. Ignore the ignore the fact that there's clouds behind you. Um, currently, we're on a walk down to the little beach. Yeah. Um, I might see a wild test in our lips. Yeah, well maybe happen. if you're okay. Don't know what they're up to. Oh, I will see you in a moment. Still feel too tired to be good at this. So I'm gonna give you a full tour tomorrow. Bye.